Now, looking at uh, grinding out the tokens here from the Egoista contest. Now, I'm not particularly gunning for a top percentage run on this one, but my Egoista is maximum blueprinted. But at the same time, I'm gonna do, yeah, I've been putting in times of 130-ish, which is three seconds uh, to spare to um, get those all those tokens out of this event. So I said I'd throw up a run of this and the pathway I'm taking here to get this. Like, it is a fairly tough run to get all the tokens, but you should be easily enough able to do this in the four or five star version to maximum kind of grind out this one. But yeah, I've got this card tuned up quite a bit. I'm missing a few of the epic and poor parts from it, but at the same time, like, it's, um, it's not exactly the fastest of S rank cars. Definitely very, very similar in speeds and handling and car size to the uh, Ferrari FX6K. But uh, it's one to kind of chase after a small amount, I would say. But maybe not go too crazy and like don't bankrupt yourself for tokens on this car's packs. It's not a bad car in particular. It looks amazing. It's just a case of, uh, yeah, just keep the budget in mind when it comes to spending tokens on it. Because it's not exactly like unique when it comes to s rank cars it is very very similar to that ferrari which is very freely available be careful as much as possible here to avoid like losing speed when you drop off there because this car is quite long so it doesn't handle it too well if you um kind of awkwardly drop it down off ledges and just try and skim underneath the bridge here and aim for this ramp go up and over the sign so that you've got a straight instead of going around that S uh, corner at the top. And then just yeah, nitro towards the finish. She, ah, <laughs> it didn't quite get under the 129. Oh well. But yeah, like these events are fairly notorious for not a lot of people competing in them. So like I said, it's quite difficult to get towards those top percentages always. I haven't tried to work out exactly um, how many people have competed in this. I know James Sinclair, who comments on a couple of my videos, is really pretty handy for um, spying how many people are actually in these events. Because you can tell if you've got an, uh, an alt account with the car, because you can put in a poor time with it. But there are some crazy tokens to be earned here if you do have this one. And like, yeah, say there's three seconds to spare there over um, the like time required for it. And my version of the Egoista is uh, like, it's max blueprinted. But yeah, you're talking about 4,100 rating. I have another video that suggests the fact that like with a Porsche, I do have a run between a 3,000 rated and a 4,000 rated Porsche over the exact same track, uh, thanks to an event that was on before. I'll put a link to that video down in the description of this if you're interested. But yeah, basically the difference over the sake of like a, a two minute race with, with that Porsche was about three seconds. So like, even though this car is 4,100 rated, if you've got this around a 3.1 to 3.3K, you should be able to nail that one minute and 33 time and get yourself some tokens from this. But definitely, like if you already have the trial um, completely milked of tokens, it, like considering this one's worth definitely chasing down and just trying it out and seeing how you get on with that contest. And even if you've got a fairly poor version of this car, please do place a time into that contest because the more people who do compete in that, the more rewards there'll be for everyone. Because obviously like say, every 100 other people who compete even with like a really poor version of the car every 100 people will mean that that one percent at the top gains one extra player because yeah that's just like how these events work in terms of the rewards so the more people who compete the uh, better it is for everyone also i do have to say the ego is that i love the fact that i'm not sure if you spotted this but the rim choice that you pick in terms of the colors uh i've got yeah this special skin on but yeah the rim choice that you pick selects the actual colors of the intake valves on the uh front and backs of the car as well as well as the actual underside on those um uh, aerodynamic flips that pop up so like they're all like orange trimmed because these are orange rims if you give the car like a crazy kind of blue or a greenish color and take a look at those and uh, the fins on the inside of this and you'll notice the fact that yeah they all get that um the same color as the car rims that you choose so it is a really nice car it's just a shame that it handles and drives so similarly to that ferrari fx6k because like it's not particularly fast. I think it's max speed 227 
and yeah it has a crazy length of body thing that the actual the fxk has the exact same problem with it that certain tracks like say rome would be a nightmare to do in the egoist i find just because of the fact that the car length is so so long so Definitely it's the one where I would be kind of advising a bit of caution with throwing a ton of tokens after. But, you know, if you can throw a small few tokens after this one and max it out, like I actually managed to luckily do in this one, uh, yeah, it's worth uh, having in the garage because, like, it's a fairly unique looking car as much as, unfortunately, it's not a unique handling car. But I'm going to stop rambling because that's a nice car. But, yeah, <laughs> I'm going to stop. And, uh, yeah, sub button over my head here, guys. Really appreciate if you give a click on these if you are still listening. And there's other videos from me here and here. Happy farming those tokens and good luck placing a time in this contest. Again, I'm not really crazily pushed on trying to gun for those top 1% in these because usually so few people compete those like the top one percent bracket in the last one of these i think was there something like 50 or 60 cars in it which is an insane kind of task to try to get into but at the same time if you're up in those top 60 cars and one percent grats to you otherwise for other people enjoy farming the tokens out of this one and i hope this video helped guys